It was already tough enough to recruit and retain good police officers. Then came the nationwide movement to defund the police, and cops all over America started jumping ship. One of the major challenges uh, facing the country is the widespread recruiting and retention dilemma. In fact, California has lost thousands of officers in the recent years and currently has the lowest number of patrol officers since 1991. With numbers like that, police departments all over the country are looking for new ways to recruit new people, specifically women who have children. It was personally more stressful to me than being injured in the line of duty. I nearly quit my job a number of times because of the demands of shift work, daycare, and the financial strain involved. Leading the way to remove some of that stress and strain for San Diego police, a first-of-its-kind child care center exclusively for cops and their families in San Diego. I'm a father to an eight-year-old and a six-year-old and the husband to a police detective, and I know all too well the struggles of trying to raise a family and a two- police officer household that has created a huge struggle and burden both financially and just operationally for the workings of how, how we take care of our, our kids at home. With excitement building for the grand opening here in January, Congressman Scott Peters has now introduced a bill that would do the same for police departments all across the country. A lack of access to child care is a nationwide challenge and it disproportionately affects a woman's employment potential. This is particularly evident in law enforcement, where women make up only 12% of sworn officers and 3% of police leadership. Along with adding benefits like child care, a nationwide push has begun to entice more women into a profession that has long been dominated by men. San Diego PD is one of hundreds of agencies nationwide who has joined the 30 by 30 initiative to have 30% female recruits in our academies by the year 2030. San Diego PD is at 16%, which is better than the national average, but I know we can do better.